You have got now aeroplanes, that's nice, but you cannot reach any of the material planets. So if you want to go to the spiritual planet, then you can make an aeroplane which has speed of the mind or the speed of the air. Uh, those who are physicists, they know what is the speed of air, what is the speed of light. So, uh, uh, the above the speed, the speed of mind. Those who are physicists, they know, they know the, uh, how speedy is air and light. The mind is, is more, still more speedy. You have got experience. Uh, now you are sitting here. Immediately, within a second, you can go to America, USA, India. Immediately, you can go to your home. You can see things <laughs> with mind, of course. Mind speed. So, in Brahma Sangita says that even with, you can manufacture one aeroplane which has the speed of the mind, which has the speed of the air. Panthastu Kuti Satavasa Sampragamo, and with that speed you go on for many millions of years. Still you will not find where is Guru Guna. Still you will not find. Panthastu Kuti Satavasa Sampragamya, Vayura Thapi Manasu Munipungavana. It is not that. The previous Acharyas and others, they did not know what is aeroplane, what is speed, how to run. Don't think foolishly. They as if they are manufacturing. It is nothing, third, not even fourth class, tenth class. Uh, there are so nice aeroplanes. Uh, now here is the suggestion that you can manufacture an aeroplane which can run on the speed of mind. Now here is the suggestion. Do it. You can manufacture an aeroplane which may run at the speed of the air. Uh, they are thinking that they, at the speed of the light, if we can manufacture one aeroplane, still it will take forty thousands of years to reach the topmost planet. Uh, they are thinking if it is possible. But uh, so far, we can see those who are busy with bolts and nuts, uh, how this dull brain can they can manufacture such things? That is not possible. Oh. It requires another brain. Uh, the yogis can go. The yogis can go. Uh, just like Dupashamani. He uh, went to Vaikuntha Loka and he saw personally Lord Vishnu and he was going to look up for being excused because his disc was after him to kill. He insulted the Vaishnava. Uh, that is another story. So, so in this way, uh, actually human life is meant for that purpose, to understand uh, God and His potencies and to revive our old relationship with Him. Uh, that is the main business. Uh, but unfortunately, they are being engaged in factories and other work to work like hogs and dogs, and their whole energy is being spoiled. Uh, not only spoiled, but their characters, uh, they are working so hard. So after working so hard, they must drink. Uh, intoxication. Then after drinking, they must eat meat. After this deep combination, they require sex. So in this way, they are kept in the darkness. Uh, and here, these verses of uh, 
Rishabde, he says, warning. He is warning, he is speaking to his sons. But we can take the lesson. Then he says, Nayana deha deha bhajang niloke, kastan kamaan arhati viru jang. Kamaan means the necessities of life. You can get your necessities of life very easily by tilling the field. You get grains, and if there is cow, you get milk. That's all. That is sufficient. But the leaders are making plans. They eat their satisfied with their farming war, little grains and meal, then who will work in the factory? Therefore they are taxing. So that you cannot live even simple life. This is the position. Even if you desire, the modern leaders will not allow you, will force you to work like dogs and hogs and asses. This is the way Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama.